tell me what it feels like when you drop back there, especially on that pass to Jacobs and the long one to Moore when you really let it rip. Yeah, it's it's exciting. Uh, when you when you see the guy open down the field, it's almost as if you you have to kind of calm yourself really quick before you make the throw. Because sometimes if you get too anxious or jittery, that's when you miss. Um, but yeah, seeing those guys open down the field is always awesome. Was there something that you guys did going into the week to kind of emphasize the vertical passing game, or was that just what you were given? No, just that was just really what we were given. Um, we knew that we could take some shots on them, and we had to take advantage of them, and I think we did that. How comfortable are you now with the playbook and the offense after nine minutes? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty comfortable in the offense. Um, like I've been saying, uh, I, I felt like in the pocket and stuff too, I've been feeling a lot more comfortable and confident in my decisions. It seemed like there were a lot of one-on-one -on -one matchups down the field available for you. Did you feel the same way? Yeah, definitely. Um, we, we like our guys a lot down the field, making plays. Um, we think we have some pretty special guys. Mm -hmm. So uh, getting them one-on-one -on -one in space always uh, is, is big. On the last drive, did Ty knock the ball out of your hands on that uh Exchange or did that just fall I out? Actually, I actually think I hit it off my knee. Um, mm -hmm. I was trying to pull it and I think I just hit it off my knee. Luckily, I got it back. You're very good at dribbling a football. <laughs> that was impressive. What was it like to see Jake Funk? You know, he doesn't always get that many touches, get two big scores. In the oh, it was awesome. It was awesome. Um, I knew I knew our guys up front would, would push them push them back and Jake running, he's a strong, powerful runner. So that was awesome.